Hi, my name is Caleb Hickam, and um, this will be a review of the film Old Boy, which was directed by Park Chan Wook uh, in 2003. Uh, not to be confused with the 2013 version, which is American, and it was a remake. Um, first off, if you haven't seen this film, I highly recommend it. It is a beautiful film, great. It's one of my favorites, and um, yeah, it's simply amazing, especially if you love foreign films. It's Korean, uh, the entire movie is in subtitles but it is seriously it's beautiful the cinematography in it is absolutely stunning from the use of long shots to uh, different lighting techniques uh, to emphasize different emotions it's just this movie has it all um, anyways um, kind of uh, a little bit about the the the, mo the movie it's a, a mystery movie uh, this man uh, just got out of a 15-year captivity, and he's on the search to figure out why he was captured and uh, why he was kept for 15 years in isolation and why he was suddenly released. And um, he's given, he uh, is given all of his diary notes from when he was in prison, a cell phone, and that's about it. Uh, he gets a phone call and is told that he has five days to figure it out. And so he just... The entire movie is this journey of him trying to discover, you know, the entire story behind it. And I'm not going to spoil it, uh, because I don't know if whoever is watching this has seen it, and I would hate it if someone spoiled this movie for me. But, um, anyways, uh, throughout the movie, um, the director, Park, uses a lot of different techniques to really, uh, show what the character is feeling and he just makes the viewer he made me feel so many different things at so many at different parts of the movie uh one thing he uses is uh the use of long shot in one scene in particular it's this fight scene that takes place in a corridor and it, it's kind of like it's not the entire screen i would say like this part's black this part's black and then it's just like corridor and it's just like gangsters walking and him beating them up and stuff and uh in that scene itself, there's a lot of different things that go on from uh, just the choreography is absolutely great. It lasts like five minutes or something like that, but the lighting is a, a pale green. It's very unsaturated, and he just just fights them all off, and it just shows his, his motivation, his desperation to get to the bottom of this. And, um, you know, at the end, he gets the elevator. It opens. There's a bunch more gangsters in there. He gets in. The elevator opens at the bottom and they all fall out and uh, so many times in the movie it shows just his power and his motivation to get to the bottom of of the mystery and um, he ends up meeting this young woman and they have a love interest and uh, it almost has this French romance film sort of lighting where it's like shadowy everywhere except for the eyes and there's a warm lighting behind them and it just gives off so many different feelings of uh, romance and you just feel so much for this guy and uh, the director definitely did a phenomenal job on this and um, even at certain points he used different sound techniques like he had the main character had a lot of internal monologues and he would just say lines to himself that were definitely just intended for the audience to hear uh, and it just it added so much to this character and you just feel so much for him that it is absolutely beautiful up until the end and the twist is so amazing and I highly recommend watching this um, I could go on for minutes this is actually the second recording because the first one I did took lasted 15 minutes so uh, anyways um, beautiful film uh, it's on Netflix if you want to watch it I highly recommend it uh, thank you so much for watching this video uh, I'm Caleb Hickam and uh, Goodbye. <laughs>